Hi everyone, my name is Jason and welcome to the Edvitech YouTube channel. Today we'll be going over the calibration of your Edvitech branded lab micropipette. Now doing this only takes about 5 to 10 minutes of your day. However, it is integral for maintaining the accuracy and precision needed in a proper lab environment. Let's go over how you do this. First off, the main things you will need would be your laboratory micropipette, your tip, a small volume of distilled or tap water, a calibrated pan balance, and some type of a vessel to dispense into. Now that we have all of this covered, let's get started. Set the micropipette to its maximum value. Remember, one milliliter of water is equal to one gram. Dispense the known value of water into a teared weigh boat on the balance. If the mass of the liquid is higher or lower than the volume set on the pipette, then your pipette needs some adjusting. To begin recalibration, remove the clear plastic label cover, as well as the label itself, from the top of the pipette. Removing both of these will reveal a small red tab that is affixed tightly to the dial of the micropipette. Pull back on the red tab to release the locking mechanism on the dial. While holding the red tab back, Pull up on the dial and you should feel it pop up and become loose. While continuing to hold the red tab, turn the dial until the readout on the micropipette matches the actual measured weight displayed on the balance. Once this value has been set, push down on the dial to its original position and release the red tab to lock it into place. Let's test the pipette to see if our adjustment was successful. Reset the volume to the maximum value or a baseline readout that you wish to test. Draw up the liquid and dispense it into the teared weigh boat on the balance. The weight displayed on the balance should approximately match the volume set on the micropipette, plus or minus, say 5%. If the readout still doesn't come close to what it should, simply repeat the previous steps until the volume of liquid closely matches the value on the balance. And there you have it. It is that simple. You now have an effectively calibrated lab micropipette. If you liked this video, and if you would like to see more tutorials on maintaining and working with your laboratory equipment, please feel free to like and subscribe to our channel. And if you'd like, feel free to leave a comment down below with what you like my And if you'd like, feel free to leave a comment down below with what you might want to see in the future. As always, thank you for watching. My name is Jason and see you around.